Suzanne here with the Crafty Cask at the American Distilling Institute's Craft Spirits Conference. And we're going to be walking around and meeting some new friends and asking them what craft means to them. Craft to me, and, uh, and I'm a distiller myself, to me was always that we have to be better than the, uh, the large industry. That means we have to produce top-notch product. Uh, the, the whole idea from, uh, uh, let's say, from fields to bottle, from grain to bottle, uh, is great. But only if distillers are properly educated and really do a nice job. Then craft is unbeatable. Craft means becoming something unique and different that sets you apart from your neighbors and your community. And it creates a draw to share that with everyone and really share something unique that you've created with the world and everybody else that you know. Learning a trade or a craft from you know, people who knew more than you and actually spending the time and the effort and the hours to, to learn how to you know, create a product yourself, basically. Craft distilling means sharing with your friends and your family and leaving a, leaving a legacy of something that can be built on for future groups and future generations. For me personally, craft is someone who just really cares intensely about what they're doing, you know? When you're crafting something, you're putting your heart and your soul into it. So I think that's kind of the, the defining moment for me. It doesn't matter if it's 1,000 cases or 100,000 cases. If you really care about what you're doing, you're putting that, that love into it, to me that's craft. Craft means to me the ability and the excitement of blending and doing your own thing, your own grains, your own botanicals for gin, your own molasses for rum. We're really excited because we grew our own rye. We're a certified farm distillery and we grew our own rye for our rye whiskey and we're very excited to start that process. Uh, craft means it's, it's local, it connects with the customer um, there's a story behind it and I feel like it's an artisanal product that, that you can't mass produce. People, about the artists behind the product, the people that are making the, the product that you're enjoying. I think about, you know, my products as craft because I, you know, they're recipes that I've developed. Um, I make them start to finish all on my own. They're definitely handmade in that regard. I have one word when I think of craft because I think the word craft is being probably overused now and I think of it as authentic when a product and the story behind the product is very authentic and real.